What's that, Faisal? I got, I got it. I got the shipment. Okay. We're gonna open it up and we're gonna use it in a couple of days, and I'm gonna catch a few bees. All right. Let's let's go. let's go around back and see yeah. what's what's in there. Let's see. So this is the first box. Let's see what Sea Falcon has uh, given Faisal to use. Very heavy. What do you think those are? <laughs> okay. Covered it. Covered yeah, it. Japanese newspaper. Japanese. That's always a good thing. A good thing. Okay. Oh my God. Okay. <laughs> okay. Let's let's put them all here. Oh, let's arrange them. Oh, three thirty cutlass. Oh my God. This. That's the heaviest, I believe. Or there's a four hundred. <laughs> let's line them all up. All right. Let's see. Holy. <laughs> Well, this is too quick. This, this is something. <laughs> They're all something, aren't They're they? They're all something. That is a 500 gram this is drain. Really cool. This is really cool. Yeah. I like this a lot. So basically the reason I selected the drains that I did select, so I mean, first basing it off of just what the drains are. So for example, this drain right here, this is the uh, squid, the slow squid. This is really, really cool. They, there's a lot of, the squid season is just coming up in Fujera. And um, and it's just, it's just the perfect bait, because there's a lot of them where we fish. And as for like the weights of the jig, you'll notice that like this is 500. This one is uh, 500 as well. Um, I mean, every, everything, everything in here is like over 300 grams for the jigs, mainly just because of uh, you know, we, we fish off of a free drifting boat and um, because of that, we have to use pretty heavy jigs so that we can get the jig to the bottom as quickly as possible with the line being as straight as possible so that, you know, we can work the jig to their full potential. Yeah, this is just amazing. This stuff is really good. You, you can see here, I'm actually, most of the jigs I did select kind of do have squid... Like, squid themed. Squid themed kind of, you yeah. know what I mean, you know, like... There's some there, this for example as well. Um, this is mainly all of that stuff is made just because of the upcoming season. But then I mean they they'll work all year round as well. You know? Squid is squid, yeah. Squid yeah. will work all year round. Squid as well. is and, squid. I mean mainly you you'll see I got a lot of the same jig. I got a lot of the cutlasses. Why why the cutlass though? Okay, so wait, let me just lay them out and I'll, I'll give a. This is four hundred. This is 400. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> so they, they sent exactly what you asked for. Literally, literally exactly what I asked for. Okay, let's lay them out and then after that, let's talk about the jigs okay. individually and why you chose them. Sure, sure. Okay, so you guys, so we talked about the squid and I just wanted to move to my personal favorite, which is the cutlass. I've actually never had the opportunity to get one in this size, so I'm super happy. I mean, all sizes are good, but this especially because, you know, this is Amber Jack's favorite food. And uh, we've lost some some pretty big ones, you know, but... Uh, you're, you're talking about the real cutlass, not the, the real fish, right? The no, Amber Jack's favorite I, I, food. I'm talking about the jig. Yeah, but, but it simulates the real yeah, the cutlass. cutlass. Yeah, yeah, it simulates the cutlass fish, which, you know... I mean, there's a lot of Amber Jacks where we fish, and um, there's a lot of big ones too. And you know they're, they're they're pretty deep, so. And we need to get them fast. And I thought, yeah, exactly. You know, and having this is create a great tool. I can get down as faster than anyone, and have the, the best jig to do it as well. But we're we're currently working with uh, Sea Falcon for a, a secret project, right? Yes, yes, we are. And we're uh, working with them. And uh. Oh, just by the way, this is my favorite jig of all time. Just yeah. letting you guys know. Yeah. And and and, uh, and it's and it's going to be a 
a very special jig, right? Oh yeah, oh yeah. Well, what we're figuring out is, you know, we, how to make things better. How to make things better than they already are. Yeah. Which is difficult because you know they're Falcon, already very good, right? They're already very. You know, Sea Falcon is one of the most like their their jig shapes are all very unique and very good. Yeah. And they're one of the most copied. But I mean, you just can't get the same finishing. That you oh, sh the, show them the the one that makes a sound. Oh yeah. Listen to this, guys. Okay, so that's pretty much the first jig that has a rattle. That is ridiculous. Yeah. <laughs> that is crazy. I mean, if you look like, like just look at this for example, you know, like this, this would be really good because um, where we, where we've been fishing, we found some new places and, you know, there's so much bait down there that um, I don't know if I have a picture, but I actually, I was just jigging and I, so I just felt a bit heavy. And I bring it up from what, 200 meters and I see a little, fish this big <laughs> yeah it's on my on my hook you know pretty much the same shape exact same shape as this and i think that's gonna be that's that's gonna present a, a good silhouette oh yeah oh yeah these are i mean all of them and these are all i picked these based on the conditions i have where i fish but i mean they're all so good you can literally use them anywhere and you also have some casting lures I, I do have some casting lures so if you see here the sinking tuna so this is gonna be a really good asset for me because the long tail tuna season is like it started now basically we we caught a few before uh, we you went to school we did how many did you catch like what 10 11 11 11 yeah. and like one like it was just like two three hours which is kind of crazy and then, actually yeah. it was only two three hours we yeah. had to go back it was it yeah was, you know and i mean this will just destroy them yeah. So at first we were hooking just bonitos. Yeah, we were. We, they, the <laughs> bonitos were just, you know, they were popping up everywhere, and we just kept hooking them. And yeah. And behind the bonitos were the tuna. Exactly. So exactly. if you can get past the bonitos, you catch the tuna. Exactly. And this is where, because I was casting a forty gram, mm -hmm. and the fifty gram, mm -hmm. but the sixty gave that extra ten gram exactly. gave you it gave you Literally, the, the yeah. I, I specifically remember. That. Yeah. Like exactly. Yeah. You, it did. was giving you a bit more distance, and behind them, that was it. As soon as it landed, you 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 dragged it once, Literally bang, once, boom, yeah. We're on, you know, and that was every cast. Yeah. So. But yeah, guys, this is really amazing. I mean, just look at this. What's Dude, the what's the color that that actually uh, just uh, kind of uh, you know kind of attracts you? I mean, is it not obvious? <laughs> <laughs> is it all? I mean. <laughs> Uh, yeah, yeah. I, I just believe in pink. Yeah. You know what I mean? I just think that yeah, it works for me the most. And that's that's for a whole year. Oh, but yeah. I think but I think what's what's gonna be really good would be the squid colors as you mentioned earlier. Oh yeah, now for for, for, for this particular oh, season. Definitely. You know, for for the season coming up, I think you know, and when I'm talking squid season coming up, I, I mean a lot of them. Yeah. A lot of squid. Yeah. You know, and if we can you know, because they're 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 pretty big too. Oh yeah, and I mean, if we can mimic them with something like this, yeah, you know, we'll build. Because we've used the smaller ones here in the Dubai, in we Dubai, have, the we Dubai have. coast, and uh, I mean the 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 Gulf, and it's been very successful. I mean, guys, which is which is odd, by the way, if I may interject here, because barracuda don't touch them. They, hmm? Barracuda don't touch them. Do they not? No. That, I don't know. To be honest with you, I haven't had the opportunity to use like the smaller ones here in Dubai. The smaller ones here in Dubai, I've never had a barracuda cut them. Yeah. Yeah. That's, That's at least for me. Well then, hopefully this will last me. <laughs> not not on a first drop. <laughs> hopefully. Yeah. But man, these things are just crazy. You know what? There's there's some really really big fish where we go. Yeah. And I mean, I think with. This being the first selection, I mean, even... Like, there's more. There's more coming, but I mean, even... even I saw your list. So, yeah. it was it was a it was a good list. I think with, with you know, the, the all, all these, this amazing selection, you know, I'm able to, I'll be able to catch some of those. Yeah, but what's surprising me is actually your se selection of the weight. But it's, uh, considering the, the, the spots that we're fishing now, yeah. I think it's, uh, and even the equipment. Even yeah. the equipment itself, we've we've actually moved up. Of course, I mean, li listen, guys. Like, honestly, 
I've lost so many fish there. W whether it's getting schooled or you know they, they take the me last time we'll show the hooks. Yeah, we'll or, show or, the or hooks. they take me into the into the reef or into the wreck. You know, I've I've lost just too many fish, and then you know using heavier equipment. I think is definitely necessary. Yeah. The, my last trip I went on before I went to study, we uh, we hit this new spot and. Uh, Long story short, um, 20 minutes into the fight, my hooks are open. So, <laughs> what to do? But and we didn't touch the, you didn't touch the drag, you didn't adjust it, it just nothing, it just muscled its way off. It literally did. What to do, you know? But uh, I think dropping one of these down there, I think that fish is still there. So I think with one of these, he'll bite again. You know? so, Actually, there are bigger fish around now. Oh, yeah. Now. Yeah, yeah. Or, or his mom. Yeah, he's <laughs> probably the granddad. Yeah, granddad. All right, so cool. So we'll, um, we'll have a video when we're actually using these. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Or you are. Lots of videos. <laughs> Lots of videos. Okay, and then um, what do you call this? Uh, once the... Uh, Here, guys, wait, I'm going to say First drop. Why that? Huh? Why that? Why this? Yeah. I don't know. I just lean forward. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. First drop, guys. <laughs> uh, Faisal's really not. Uh, what do you call this? But Faisal's really not uh, saying it. But what he doesn't know is that there's already a video of why. So that's what he chose. And on the 14th, if you look at the, or if you look at the forecast, it'll give you the reason why exactly. But the video of uh, how to select your first drop. It's actually on the, uh, it's on already in the channel. Yeah, really cool video. Alrighty, so. Um, Guys, this is just crazy, you know? But, uh, <laughs> but I'm telling you. We'll do another unboxing video when, when the new boxes come in. We will, we will. And um, yeah. Alright, so Faisal, good. thanks so much for uh, showing us the uh, new toys. Not for it, for and it. then, uh, well, we'll see you guys on the boat then. Yeah. Alrighty. See you guys. Hopefully we get them. Alrighty. So that's it for now. Thanks for watching. And uh, here, just to give you guys a good view on these things, of these things. So. Alright, so thanks, Martin. Thank you so much, Martin. Honestly, this is amazing. This Alrighty. Is really amazing. Cool. So, uh, yeah, next box. I think they're coming out of their golden weekend. So the next uh, box or two, probably, uh, if they can ship it in one shipment, I think they're just going to do that. But uh, yeah, we'll do another unboxing video. Hopefully, uh, it arrives before we go out. Hopefully, it does. I mean, regardless, we're going to get it, you know. So, yeah. <laughs> so let's see, guys. Next time, it's just we'll be on the boat. All righty. So that's it for now, guys. Thanks so much for watching. We'll see you in the next one.